Welcome to Operation Side Hustle with Piers. My name is Piers and the goal of this channel is to turn £25 into £25,000. Um, I'm going to be frank with you guys. I've not been doing this for probably well over a year now. It's just coming up or it's just gone Christmas. It's just coming up to New Year. It's probably just about New Year's Eve as we're speaking now. I think it's just coming up to 12 o'clock. And I've had a week off basically. I've had a week off work. Often I thought, you know what? I'm gonna see if I can flip some furniture. I'll see how I get on. And in the past seven days, apart from Christmas, I've been flipping stuff. I've flipped 10 tables in seven days and I've gone from 25 pounds up to 310 pounds. I'll pop some photos up in one of the corners of the tables that I've been flipping. But you know what I've realized? It's still a massive money maker and it fits what I do. It fits my kind of lifestyle. Furniture flipping, super easy. Super simple, all done through Facebook Marketplace. Pick items up, they fit in my car. I can do it as I'm kind of traveling around. So I'm gonna bring you along for the journey, hoping I can roughly pay off my mortgage every month, which is roughly a thousand pounds. Thousand pounds a month in 12 months time, that's 12 grand. Let's see how we go, see you in a bit. Good afternoon, welcome back. Um, it is a miserable rainy day on New Year's Eve. On my way to go and pick up two tables, so I'm gonna nip and pick up one, which is about sort of half an hour away and then there's one much closer to home. I'm currently in a hire car, because my car is in the shop getting repaired because someone hit my wing mirror, unfortunately. So I'm hoping I can fit both tables in, but we'll see how we go. If not, I might have to run home first and then pick up the second one, but busy afternoon. And then I'm getting ready to go out and party. I've just evening. picked up this solid oak table. I've paid 40 pounds for that one. Uh, I think I've overpaid a little bit. I would have liked to have paid 30, but they originally wanted 60, so kind of came down by 20. So that's not bad. I reckon I'll get 70 or 80 for that, so that's a decent flip. I think I should be able to get two in the back there if I put them on their side. So uh, yeah, let's get to it. See you in a bit. Right, just picked up the second table. Thankfully it fit. Bizarrely, the people were keeping it outside and I don't know if you can see, but it's raining. My wing mirrors are on. Bit random, gave me some bits. Apparently that's for a shelf, but I paid 30 pounds for that one. It's, yeah, it's not the best quality. I reckon I'll get 50 or 60 for that, so I should get double my money. But plan is now, it's just come up to quarter past four. We're going out for New Year's Eve at half six. We need to leave at about 6.15. So head home, get these tables unloaded, get the photos uploaded and onto the, onto the marketplace so that I can hopefully get them sold quickly. Then head out and party. Let's catch up soon. Home sweet home, let's get these tables unloaded. Let's go. Just got both those tables measured up and the photos taken. This one is a really beautiful, like solid oak piece. Uh, it's got like a nice kind of like storage bit underneath. So I'm gonna get that one listed for, I think I'm gonna put it on at 90, look to take anything from sort of 75 upwards. This piece here that I picked up that I paid 30 for, I paid 40 for the one over there. This one 30, nowhere near as good quality, but it's coming up to New Year now. I'm about to go back into the house, get a quick shower, and then we're heading out. We're going for a, a children's New Year, whatever that is. Who knows, but it should be good fun. I hope you guys all have a good, good New Year. You all have a nice time this evening. If you're not at home, just chilling out. I hope you enjoy that as well. I'm very jealous of you guys. But I will see you all in the New Year. See you in a bit. Well, Happy New Year to everyone. I hope you're doing well. Checking in a little bit earlier than I was expecting. Just back after a busy night out, really good fun with the kid. Uh, went out with the grandparents as well. And my little daughter had a fantastic time. So yeah, very, very happy with that. Hope you guys had a good time as well. But while I was out, someone's been messaging me about this table and they want some additional photos. So it's coming up to 1 a.m. and it's time to take some photos because I want to make a sale, potentially looking to drop this off tomorrow morning at like 9 a.m. So. I've got my pledge out, I'm gonna give it a quick clean, then I'm gonna take some extra photos. He wants some photos of like the damaged feet because I had to tell him about it. So let's get to it. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How's everyone doing? Busy day ahead. I've got to nip out and pick up a table, which is what I consider like a double win. So I'm buying it for like a really, really good price, paying 25 pounds for it. And I reckon it's gonna be worth up there as the premium offering, sort of around the 75, 80 pound mark. So. Very excited about that, and I'm picking up another table tomorrow. I potentially got someone else picking up another table this evening as well. Plus, I'm gonna do a whole day of work. Let's get to it. Catch you guys once we're picking up the table. See you in a bit. 
Wow, what a palaver that was getting that table in. I had a whole setup getting ready for you guys to record and film me getting it in the car. But my God, that table weighed an absolute ton. Um, I ended up having to get someone to help me off the street so I couldn't be recording. I've got it in the car. It's now time to head to work, but it's gonna be a struggle getting this thing unloaded when I get home later. I'm gonna to have to pull the car right up and I'm just gonna to have to, I don't know what I'm gonna do, but we'll figure it out. But got it in the back. It's a beauty. We have absolutely made a score. I reckon it's like a hundred pounds worth of table. It's mango wood, so I'm really excited about that. But yeah, time to head to work now. Catch up with you guys in a little bit. See you soon. Right, let's get this thing unloaded. I've got a couple of sheets. I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to plonk it down and then slide it somehow, but this thing weighs an absolute ton. So I'm gonna pop you guys down. Let's crack on with this table. Well, it only fell a little bit. Right, so I've got the table in position now. Once I got it into like the, well, over the lip of the door, it was pretty easy just to move. I could just slide it. So it's all set up, but this piece is an absolute beauty. I need to get some stuff to stage it later. Pay 25 pounds for that. I'm really, really impressed. I'll get it all staged up. I'll pop some photos up. Um, but I think I'm gonna get that listed for probably around, I think we might start it at 100 and just see how we go, just see how we get on, but very pleased indeed. Pretty good start to the morning. Just had someone come and pick up the big solid wood kind of pine, not solid pine, mango wood piece. They paid 80 pounds for that one, so that's a really nice ROI. Just got this one unloaded. It's kind of like a little pine table. Can't remember what I paid for it. I think I paid maybe 30, but 20, 25, something like that, 30 pounds at most. Well, still heavy, or relatively. Gonna get the photos of that one taken and then get some stuff listed. Hopefully gonna be buying another table later today as well, but pretty good start to the morning. Well, good evening. Just got this table unloaded. I thought I picked up a really nice table. I only paid 30 pounds for this. It's kind of like a, I think it's probably pine, but it kind of looks like oak. I'll list it as solid wood. I thought I picked up an absolute bargain, but I've just seen it's got quite a bit of damage. And if you can see over here, there's this kind of scrape here. I have just tried to kind of color it in. I know that sounds daft, but I've got these color correction pens, try and color it in. Made it look a little bit better, but it's definitely got a scratch on it. There's also some paint on the side that I've just had to sand off. So not quite as good as I was expecting, but still, I think we'll be able to make a decent profit on that one. I think I said I said paid 30 pounds. We'll get it listed for something like 60, 55 around that mark. Happy days. Let's crack on. Whoa, hello, welcome back. Haven't spoken to you guys in a couple of days. I'm out of breath. Just carried this table in. Purchased that one for 15 pounds yesterday. It was pretty beat up, but for 15 pounds, I'll see what I can do with it. Oh my God, it was so heavy though, my God. So I've just got that one unloaded out of the car because I now need to go and deliver this table this evening once I finish work. So I'm just gonna get that one loaded up. Oh, wowza. And then I'm definitely gonna come back and we're gonna do a bit of a summary. I keep saying it, but we're actually gonna do it. See you later tonight. Good evening, welcome back. I just sold that table that you just saw me talking about, the kind of the brown mahogany one. So I paid 15 pounds for that one and I sold it for 45. So not a huge amount of profit, a good RRI, but still the money's ticking over. I wanna do a quick wrap up now. I've still got this kind of pine table um, that I, I'm trying to sell. I've got that down to 55 pounds, but just as a little bit of a summary, I don't know how many tables we've sold over the last couple of days, couple of weeks, but probably in excess of 10 or 15 tables. We're currently up to 435 pounds worth of cash. And then I've got 30 pounds invested in the table over here. So let's call that 465, uh, which is a pretty good 
profit for, I'd probably say about three weeks worth of work now. So give it another week, we might be up at above the 500 pound mark. I was aiming for a thousand pounds, didn't quite achieve that this month. Um, I think it's been a little bit slow the last couple of days, kind of middle of January, everyone's looking at their paycheck. So that might be having a bit of an impact, but still, if we can turn over 500 pounds on our first month, first month, that's pretty good going. Uh, I'm expecting that we can probably do some more next month. We can probably increase that revenue. I'm pretty pleased with the first month. Um, if you're not already, please do hit that follow button down below. Feel free to check me out on Instagram as well at Operation Side Hustle with Piers, posting loads of content there pretty much uh, daily. But I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Thank you so much, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.